All right, so super short video here. I'm just gonna go over what to do if the captures. So if they take on d5, remember we always take with the e pawn. And if they take on e4, we take with the f pawn. Um, you have this super nice pawn chain. Let's say knight e1, for example. I'll go over knight e5 too. Um, so if they go here, you have beautiful position. You got two bishops. You can rook lift. You can do all this stuff. You have a great attack here. Um, also, queen h4 is really strong. You're threatening mate on h2. Um, if g3, queen h3. Um, and now bishop g4, bishop f3 would be lights out. Um, now, if after f takes, they go knight e5, all you're going to do is kick this knight out of the way. Um, if they go f4 trying to support it, remember you have on passant. And um, we definitely want to go on passant here because it would open up our strong side. And now, once again, you got these bishops. He's got a backwards pawn. Probably what you do is like queen e7, knight f6, knight g4, and you have a phenomenal attack here. So that's what how you react to the captures in the center, as well as kind of the follow-up attack um, after that.